It's been this way for probably about four, three, four weeks. Mike Hazen is talking about this, the brown grass outside his Agoura Hills home. This stinks a little bit. Ever since a drought emergency went into effect last December in the Las Virginas Water District, people have been asked to conserve. Watering now is only allowed once a week. Everyone has a water budget. If you go over it, you may get hit with financial penalties. Staying in budget leads to brown grass at Hazen's house. I think I'm doing my part. I'm trying to do my part. But while he's doing his part, the water district serves about 75,000 residents and relies on a water supply that's dangerously low. The district covers the sprawling hills of multi-million dollar mansions in western L.A. County. CBS2 investigates found that according to Water District public records we obtained, some celebrities are among those who aren't following the rules that everyone else has to follow. My name is Kourtney Kardashian, and these are three rooms in my home. Take reality star Kourtney Kardashian. She lives in this $8 million home in Calabasas. Water records we obtain show the account, which is listed under a trust, used 245% of its allotted water budget in May. That's almost one and a half times more than what's budgeted. The fourth month, it went over budget. <laughs> Sylvester Stallone's $18 million mansion in Hidden Hills is also on the list of those who went over budget for at least four months. Records show the account in his wife's name used 351% of its budget in May. Howie Mandel did this TikTok video from inside his estate in Calabasas. Water records in his wife's name show they used 241% of their water budget in May, also the fourth month. We also found rapper The Game. His home in Calabasas also on the list of those going over budget at least four months since December. The water supply condition is very dire. Las Virginas Water District's Joe McDermott says anyone who exceeds 150% of their budget for at least two months pays a penalty for water in an effort to try and get them to conserve. But for some, money seems to flow like water. For those customers that are very affluent and have lots of um, cash, lots of cash, financial penalties don't necessarily work. We don't think that you should be able to buy your way out of a drought. Uh, everybody needs to do their part. This is very, very serious. So you're at 26 ish gallons a minute. So the district has devised a plan. It's pretty quick and painless as far as installation. This disc, placed in the pipe at the water meter of homes over budget for four or more months, cuts flow from 26 gallons a minute. The maximum you can get is just a little under one gallon a minute. To just one. It stays on for two weeks, forcing people to conserve. I actually uh, tested one out at my house. What do you think? It wasn't great. The flow restrictor is reserved for the worst offenders with four or more months over budget. That means all of these celebrities we showed you are on the list to potentially get one, and some already have. Records we obtained show Kevin Hart got one. They show a flow restrictor was installed on his home in Calabasas with a personalized workout area. The restrictor was removed after two weeks. This mansion in Calabasas also had a flow restrictor for two weeks. The account is in the name of the estate of Michael Jackson. This home also had a flow restrictor for two weeks. The water account in the real name of rapper Nas. Imagine everybody flashing. And in keeping with the area, officials say some people, they won't say who, tried to pay their way out. Some have asked us to remove it. Um, and how much it would cost to remove it, and in which case I've refused. They want to pay you extra to get rid of it tomorrow? Yeah. yeah. Is that fair to the average person in your district? It's not fair. I'm taking the entire lawn out. Environmental activist Erin Brockovich is doing her part, but she's also on the list of those eligible for a restrictor because she's been using too much water. <laughs> But she's now installing artificial turf and drought-resistant plants and says she's reduced her water use. You are known for environmental causes. Mm -hmm. I am. Yet you are listed as a water offender. In the past, there's been some months where, yes, I was above what they said I was allowed to use. I was fined. I've paid those fines. And I started taking very swift action. 
we did have a really nice green lawn. And for those like Mike Hazen who are suffering through the drought, the hope is everyone will get the message. Hopefully, we can come out of this and we can, you know, be able to get some green lawns again. Now, in response, Sylvester Stallone's lawyer tells us he has 500 mature trees on the property, saying absent adequate watering, in all likelihood, they would die. He says he is addressing the situation with the city. And Howie Mandel's representative sent us his latest water bill showing in June he had reduced his water usage. CBS reached out to others, but they did not get back to us.